correlation analysis. People are always interested in talking about and studying the relationship between various phenomena. For example, the relationship between income and expenditure, relationship between price of gold and rate of inflation, relationship between price and demand of an item, etc. If we are able to study or if we are able to establish the relationship between these variables, we could estimate the future values of these variables. Correlation analysis is a statistical tool which can be used for this purpose. Now, now let us define a co uh, correlation analysis. Correlation analysis is defined as the degree of relationship between two or more variables. Two variables are said to be correlated if the change in one variable results in a corresponding change in the other variable also. For example, if we consider the two variables as price and demand of an item, if there is an increase in price, if there is an increase in demand also, then we can say that the two variables are correlated. Similarly, if there is an increase in price, if the, there exists a corresponding decrease in uh, demand of the product, then also the variables are said to be correlated. When price of an item increases, the supply is also increases. On the other hand, if the price decreases, the supply also decreases. In this case, both variables are moved together. So we say that the two variables are correlated. It is generally assumed that when two variables are correlated, there exists a cost-effect relationship between the two variables. But there is a chance or possibility that statistically two variables are found correlated, but practically they are not correlated at all. So one must be very careful when selecting variables for studying the correlation. There are different types of correlation. They are positive correlation, negative correlation, simple, partial and multiple correlation, linear co correlation and non-linear correlation. Now let us see what is positive correlation. Correlation is said to be positive if the variables are moved in the same direction. That is, if there is an increase in one variable, the value of one variable, if there is an increase in the value of other variable also, then they move in the same direction and we say that the correlation is positive. Similarly, if there is a decrease in one variable, which, which is accompanied by a decrease in the second variable also, then also we say that the, cor uh, the variables are positively correlated. Negative correlation. In negative correlation, values of the variables move in opposite direction. If for example, if there is an increase in one variable, which is accompanied by a decrease in the other variable, then they are moving in opposite direction and the co correlation that exists between the variables is negative. Similarly, if there is a decrease in one variable and it is accompanied by an increase in the other variable, then also they are moving in opposite direction. In that co case also, the correlation is said to be negative. Simple correlation. If you are studying the correlation between only two variables, then the correlation is said to be simple correlation. For example, if you are 
studying the relationship between height and height and weight of a group of students then the correlation is simple correlation in multiple correlation we are studying the relationship between more than two variables if we study about the relationship between price demand and supply of certain commodities the correlation is multiple in partial correlation we study the relationship between two variables at a time keeping the effect of all other variables as constant we are not considering or without influence in the uh, effect of other variables we are studying the correlation between two variables at a time that is called partial correlation